Hey guys, Dustin the crew here at bowhunting.com. Day two of the 2017 ATA show here in Indy. Uh, Jake, welcome. How's it going? Pretty good. So just looking at this, I can see a whole bunch of changes over the HDX. Show, tell us a little bit about some of these changes. All right, so we actually revealed the MXT last year at the show, um, but we went in and we have throughout the year um, changed a lot of the designs both uh, externally and on some of the internal components, smoothing a lot of the internal components. The MXT is now actually in full, to full production. Um, and some of the things that we did change over last year's prototype, as you can see here, we did some of the overmolding in the capture bar. We did the overmolding in the thumb wheel, and we also changed the dials up a little bit. As far as the internal stuff, um, that, that's more of an engineering thing, and I'm not really allowed to speak about that. But uh, I can see, uh, one thing just looking at it, I can see that uh, that your thumb knob here has, or what, I don't know what the technical term is, but it looks like it's inside. It's a little bit shorter than it was last year. Is that correct? Uh, yes, I believe so. It's uh, been inset just a little bit there um, to give it a, a shorter kind of profile there. But some of the main things that uh, you will notice as over the HDX, which is our most popular rest, we did change the location of the uh, capture bar there. We put it down on this part of the housing so that what happens is anytime you make that horizontal adjustment, that capture bar shifts with the launcher fork in that part of the housing so it always stays perfectly centered over top of the launcher fork so that's a, a benefit over the hdx also on the actual housing here on the mounting block um, they've created enough horizontal adjustment that on the this mounting block will fit any bow riser by any manufacturer without needing any spacer blocks or anything like that Perfect. so the one the big thing that we see here is the micro adjustment Yes, sir. Um, these are pretty cool, guys. I'm, I'm being able to play with them here. But so one full revolution on this knob is equal to one thirty seconds of an inch of adjustment. Yes, each each click is one thirty seconds of an inch. So thirty two clicks will get you one inch of adjustment on there. And you can actually, you will actually feel the clicks as you turn the dials. You can actually feel those. And then we just have the two set screws over here. You have the horizontal and you have a vertical set screw still. So once you get that dialed in, you'll be able to snug that down and make sure that you don't, you're not bumping these dials or anything and, and throwing anything off. Perfect, what colors will this be offered in? Um, right now we are offering it in the red, the Lost XD, the Mossy Oak, and the Realtree, and of course we're all also offering it in our black option. Perfect, that uh, very cool new look from, from QAD this year. Um, this rest is called the MXT, you can check it out online. Thanks for watching. Jake, thanks for thanks for your time. Thanks.